Hey guys, my name is Kali and I'm going to show you how you can make a total free Minecraft server which will be have 4 GB of RAM and with a small trick you can make this server 24 by 7. So without wasting time, let's go guys, let me show you how you can make it. Let's go! So first thing guys, you need to open your Chrome browser on your desktop or your cell phone. After you open your Chrome browser on your desktop or your cell phone guys, in the search bar you need to type F-A-L-I-X, Felix and enter. With the first link guys, you need to go with over here and then in this window will pop up in front of you, okay? If you are having any kind of problem to load up this screen on your desktop or your cell phone guys, you need to install in your device Opera VPN browser. Okay guys, after you install Opera VPN browser in your desktop guys, what you're gonna do guys, you need to click on the VPN over here guys, after you click on VPN, this will appear over here, you need to click over here, and then you need to make this location over here, Americans, okay, in the desktop. And also guys, in your cell phone guys, you need to go in settings in Opera VPN browser, and then you need to click the location over here. Americans also okay if you are still having problem with Opera VPN browser in your cell phone guys you need to install US VPN from Play Store in your device after that I'm pretty sure guys you will not gonna have any kind of problem in your cell phone okay so we're gonna make our uh, whole video in Chrome browser guys so I will get back to the Chrome browser again let's go so guys after you come back on your Chrome browser guys right now you need to click on sign in over here guys and after you click on sign in this window will pop up over here guys you can join the, with the Google you can join with the discord guys okay but I prefer over here guys we go with the Google over here because everybody has Google account over here guys okay so right now after that guys you need to choose your uh, Google account which one you wanna go with we in the phallic over here guys okay after that guys this window will pop up over here after that guys you need to click over here in server over here and then create server guys okay you can see over here create server you need to click over here after that guys new window will come in front of you guys you need to go a little bit down over here and after that guys you can see over here create server option okay over here first thing guys you need to write over here server name we can put a server name like server server okay server one okay and then we can uh, choose the domain like S-E-R-V-E-R server 1 also. And after that, we need to click on the outside over here to check if it's available or not, okay? So as you can see, it's not available. So we're going to choose like 006 over here. We're going to change. And as you can see, we have server 006 as a domain over here, guys, okay? After that, guys, we need to uh, choose over here location. As you can see, uh, we have a two locations, Germany and also United States. So I'm from South Asia, so guys, uh, Germany is near than uh, United States for me, okay? So we will go for Germany over here. And after that, guys, we need to accept the terms and condition over here, guys. So we need to click over here, accept. And after that, guys, we need to, cre we need to press on create. So after that guys, this window might pop up in front of you. You don't need to worry guys, our server has been made already right now. Right now guys, what you're gonna do, you need to go on the address bar over here guys and then you need to delete until .net slash, okay? And then you need to press enter over here. After that guys, this window will pop up over here. You need to go a little bit down. After you go a little bit down guys, you can see that our server has been ready right now. Okay guys? So okay, right now to install software in our server guys, right now what you're gonna do guys, you need to click on your server play button over here, as you can see. Okay, after you play but click on the play button guys, this window will come over here. After that guys, you need to bring your mouse on server management. After that guys, you can see over here in server management version and software. You need to click on the version and software over here guys. After you click over there guys, this new window will pop up over here. After you scroll down a little bit guys, you can see a lot of software and version over here. E in the phallics.com you can choose one of your desire one okay but I will go over here guys with paper speed guard over here because if you install paper speed guard in your server guys it will make you less lag in your server guys okay so let's go right now guys select a version the latest version over here is 1.20.1 so and then click on install okay and after that as you can see guys over here version has been installed over here so that's literally so simple how it is so okay guys, after you install software in your server guys, right now we need to turn on our server for once. So to turn on our server guys, right now we need to go for in console over here guys. Okay, so after you click on the console guys, this window will pop up in front of you. 
after this window pop up guys you need to scroll down a little bit over here you can see the server is offline right now you need to go a little bit down and after that guys you can see over here start button restart button stop and kill button right now guys we need to start our server so we're gonna click on start button over here after we click on the start button guys we can go up right now over here and we can see that server is starting so after a while guys you can see right now the server has been online right now over here guys okay so as you can see guys our server is online after it get online guys you can see over here the server became online okay guys so okay guys after we online our server guys right now we're gonna enable our crack version to play crack minecraft player in our server and also guys we're gonna extend our server slot so we can play so many player in our server guys let's go to do so guys we need to go right now in server management over here after server management guys we got need to go in file manager over here guys well, after you click on file manager guys we it will take you in new window over here guys like this way you need to scroll down a little bit after you scroll down a little bit guys you need to find out over here server properties over here as you can see you need to click on server properties over here guys after you click on server properties guys you need to scroll down again over here after after that guys you can see so many functions over here guys after that guys we you need to find out two things over here one is max player and another is online mode okay as you can see guys to extend uh, the slot for the player guys we need to extend the max player level over here guys okay so uh, right now as you can see it's 20 guys right now we're gonna make it 100 okay and also the online mode is true right now to enable crack over here to crack crack a version minecraft player can play in our server we need to make it over here false okay so after we make it false guys what you gotta do right now guys you need to scroll down and you need to make it safe that's it guys it's done so okay guys right now i'm gonna show you guys how you can install plugins in your phallix node server guys okay to install a plugin in your server guys you guys need to go right now in server management after that guys you need to go in file manager Okay, after you click on file manager, guys, you need to scroll down a little bit, okay? After you scroll down a little bit, guys, you can see plugins folder over here. You need to click on plugins folder over here, guys, okay? After you click on plugins folder, guys, it will show you what kind of, um, how many kind of uh, plugins you have. So, as you can see, guys, we don't have any kind of plugins right now over here. Okay, so right now we're gonna upload by clicking upload file over here. We need to upload jar file of our plugins over here. To uh, download the jar file over here, guys, we need to open a new window at the beside, okay? After that, guys, in the Google, we need to search for any kind of plugins. So, guys, right now I'm gonna download the skin restore plugin over here. So, after that, guys, what are you gonna do? You can uh, find out the first speak out MC, guys, okay, over here. Uh, speak out MC is a really trusted uh, place to download plugins for your um, Minecraft server guys okay you can download um, plugins from speaker MC it's a trusted site guys okay so we'll go with the link right now over here by clicking over here guys after that guys this window will pop up in front of you after that guys you can see download button over here we can click on download to download our plugins jar file okay after that, guys you can see in our download over here our skin restore plugin is downloading right now so after it get downloaded guys right now right now you need to come back in your uh, plugins uh, folder in your server guys after that guys you need to click on upload file over here so after you click on upload file over here guys you need to choose your file where you keep in your device or your cell phone or your pc guys okay so as you can see my skin restore plugin is here guys and after that we need to open click on open guys as you can see our plugins name is jar file is been here and after that guys we need to click on upload over here guys after you click on upload guys it will get uploaded over here so sometime guys you can have like this wide skin over here guys you don't need to worry guys yo uh, plugin has been uploaded in your server so right now to check back guys what you're gonna do you need to click on back button on your browser guys it will take you back in your uh, same position in your plugins folder guys as you can see our skin restore plugin has been inst installed in our server guys okay after that guys if you want you can buy in the three dot you by clicking you can delete uh, any kind of uh, plugins if you want and also guys if you are high i mean skilled then you can edit your uh, plugins over here guys also okay so that's it over here guys to activate all of this what we have been done right now you need to go back to your console again guys and after that guys you need to take a restart 
okay to your server so everything what we have been done in our server right now like changing the slot and the crack version and also the uploaded the plugins we have been already to activate all of these guys we need to make a restart so okay guys right now we're gonna add a sub user in our felix node server to add a sub user in your felix node server guys what you're gonna do guys you need to go in advanced feature after that guys you need to click on sub user over here after you click on sub user guys you need to scroll down a little bit after that guys you can see new user over here you need to click on new user over here guys after that this window will pop up in front of you after that guys you need to fill a a gmail address or email address of your sub user okay like we're gonna use one gmail over here guys okay so after you fill one gmail over here guys what are you gonna do guys you need to press add over here guys after that you need to provide permissions over here to that person what kind of permission you're gonna provide him like i will provide all permission over here okay and after that guys what are you gonna do guys uh let me cross this one and after that guys what are you gonna do guys right now you need to press add over here guys after you click on add guys the sub user will be added to your server in your fadix node okay so that's literally simple how it is guys so okay guys right now we need to extend server time to extend server time guys what are you gonna do guys right now you need to go in console over here guys after you click on console guys console will load up you need to scroll down a little bit guys you can see the server is online after that guys you need to go in timer over here option and after that guys you can see over here add time you need to click on add time guys new window will pop up in front of you guys after that guys you can see scroll down after you make a scroll down guys you can see this one over here guys current time is gonna show you after that a verification a thing's gonna show you over here sometimes it get automatically uh, verif verified like this way sometimes it asks you to verify you can when it will ask you to just click over here it will get verified okay and after that guys this will pop up over here the button and after that guys you need to click on this button over here after you click on this button guys uh, the server will add it one hour plus in your server guys okay to check back guys you need to uh, scroll down a little bit you need to go in your server guys by clicking on play button over here okay after you go over here guys you need to scroll down again you will be in your console guys you can see guys right now we have been added one hour 53 minute over here in our server in server time guys so right now like this way you can maximum three hours in you can add in one time okay after that when it will one hour will be in that you can add again another one more hour like this way you can constantly you can add whole day hour in your server and your server will no need to turn off okay so it can help you by adding sub user okay you can add your friends in your um, list and they will be uh, they will be added they can add the time in your server so it would be really helpful there has another one way to add to make your server 24 7 so that is you need to click on add time over here guys okay after you click on add time over here guys you need to scroll down a little bit you can see always online renew for 24 hours you need to click on this one guys okay and after you click on this one guys okay you can see a link will appear over here guys okay you need to send your friends and other people this link if they will uh, register in felix.com with this link guys you will get um you know you will get guys a token over here to make your server 24 7 so by one token guys you can make your server 24 7 okay guys so make sure that when you click this uh, entire invitation link and you send your friends and after that guys you can make your server 24 7 so it's really pretty simple and easy guys for you it's gonna if you don't want okay to make this one then you can add time again again guys okay and you can tell your friends also to add time over here so by this way you can literally turn on the server how much long you want okay guys 
So okay guys, right now we're gonna join our server. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys how by joining this server from my Minecraft account, guys. Okay. So right now we need to get IP. So as you can see, guys, that this is the server IP over here. You can get it by the console going in the console, guys. Okay. So as you know that we got this domain over here, uh, server006.felix.gg. You can uh, use this one also, and also there has secondary one also. Okay, over here. This is the one. This is Pearl One Three Felix Server with the port. This is two two six two five. Is our server port guys you can use this one so right now guys let's go in my minecraft and let me show you guys how you can join this server guys let's go so okay guys so right now i'm in my minecraft right now guys what you're gonna do guys you need to click on multiplayer over here after that guys you need to add server over here guys by adding server so i have been added already the server over here so as you can see let me show you guys over here edit okay so this is the server server06.phalis.gz as you can see over there okay and also the port is 22625 okay as you saw this one over here guys okay the port is 22625 and the server IP is this one okay so I'm t I'm taking right now okay guys so okay guys after that guys we are done over here guys as you can see the slot is 100 and right now guys we're gonna go inside with by clicking over here so I'm joining right now in the server guys right now. So okay guys as you can see guys right now I am inside the server right now guys and it has a no literally not really any kind of lag as you can see. We can't feel any kind of lag right now here. Okay this is pretty smooth okay. So as you can see guys okay everything we are in a swamp biome right now guys okay. So that's what it about the whole video about making a server in Palix in a Palix node guys okay. So I hope guys you like the video guys if you like this video guys don't forget to support me with your like and subscribe okay. And see you guys with new video until then stay happy and stay blessed bye bye guys take care all of you guys.